This weapon is brilliant. Right, yes. This weapon is brilliant. As you can see, level 1. Do you need to level it up? No. Now watch this. You hold the button, and it charges up. Ha! Awesome. At level 1, it's the Polar Star. Level 2, it's a laser. At level 3, it's a... Double laser. At max, this is the only weapon that has four levels. But as you can see, it's it's a it's a constant polar star beam. And they've given us a nice shooting gallery. Come on. The nice thing about this level, this level, this gun, this gun, yes, is that it won't, you won't lose the upgrade, because there isn't an upgrade. Experience doesn't matter, so by, when you get hit, this gun is always constant, it's always the same. It's huge advantage over every other gun. Which argument, you know, you could argue that they all get weaker, other than the nemesis, but not counting the nemesis. Let's just save it. But you could say that all the other weapons get weaker. But this one gets stronger. Wait, what was I saying? It doesn't get stronger. Nah. It doesn't matter if you get hit with this weapon. That's what I was trying to say. Which is pretty cool. And this place is empty as well. And then there's... One more place. I don't think I can come to this area yet. Oh, not this area. Where's the, the graveyard? There's a area you can't get to without the... the um, debt pack. Where is he? Can I take him home yet? No. Right in here, there is a dude. There's a mushroom. No. Okay, so I can't see him yet. Wonder when that is that I. When is it that I can? Okay. We'll find out later, or I'll forget about it completely. But this is a this is a good day. Got the the jetpack and. And the spur. Okay, all he says is to do that. Labyrinth, is there anything to do there right now? Oh, yes, there is. So there's. There's this uh, chest I wasn't able to get. Of course, if you'd uh, gone down in this area when you were first here, if you'd gone down and helped uh, Booster, he would have been down here. I think he would have been here. I can't remember. But you go and you talk to him, he gives you the booster, and it only goes straight up. But as you can see, this doesn't go straight up. This doesn't just 
go straight up this booster we've got now. So this one is better. But, as I was trying to say, when you get the booster from him, it enables you to get over here and get this. Which you can't do normally. Because there's no way to jump. Had it been great if I'd made that. Oops. You can't jump from this side. No. I should probably turn the booster off or something, but... Ah, oh, crap. Charge up to max. Overkill. 45 damage. Yep. Crap. Those things are pretty annoying. Because you have to get them out of the jump. Go away. Or you just shoot them right away. That works too. I guess. Oh, the sword's not maxed up anymore. Fireball's not maxed. And bubbles aren't maxed. They're not gonna... Not gonna, not gonna be able to do that on its own. Ah, I thought it was dead. Crap, that made it even worse again. But yeah, the booster's nice. Ah, crap, you jerk. Oops. Bubbles. There we go. I like to see. Right. Sorry, I'm kind of just messing around. This is where we want to go. It's the chest on the um, missiles. What does that do? Oh. Okay. It means you'll lose your weapons all downgrade slower. Which is nice. Not vital. But nice. Ouch. Ha. <laughs> level down, level up. Oh, that's good. Yep, Court's long gone now. I don't even know where he is. Levels down, level up, level down, level up. It's because it's not losing us as much of its experience now that I've got that arm thing. Don't know why I jumped up there, I don't need to. Hmm, wonder if there's, there's a teleporter back that way. Oh, we can go get the, the other item for this. This gun. Let's see. I actually like this even though it's not really 
anything you can rely on or anything great. But I like it. It's it's kind of nice. The whimsical star. Yep, the spur is an ultimate weapon. Now, this, the most well, there, mumble mumble. The whimsical star is kind of cool. The way you use it is you charge this up to full power, and then you have little stars flying around. They don't do too much damage, unfortunately, but. They can be kind of a minor shield, and they can do some damage to enemies. They can only do like one per hit. Is there any point going this way? No, let's go back. But we'll see in a second. Uh, I'll go save it. Always save. Even now. Two. Now when you get hit, you lose a star. Ha! <laughs> I killed him. Come on. So if you've never seen this kill anything before, it can. Oops. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna waste time on that. Oh yeah, the other nice thing about this not leveling down is if you want to get through an area and you know you're gonna get hit and you don't want to lose any weapon upgrades, you just equip this. Of course, you'd rather just not get hit, but sometimes that just isn't possible. Boost. Now that we've got the jetpack. Oh, shoot. Water is not going to be too much of a pub, but we do have the bubble. Pretty nice. I'm trying to think, is there anything else that I can get now that I couldn't before? Any kind of hell for upgrades? I don't think so. And by upgrades, I meant missile upgrades. max health in this game is 50 so until I have 50 health then I'm missing something but I don't remember where all the little health upgrades are and the way out is down So we will save. So this was just kind of a. I think I only got two items in this video. I'm gonna I'm gonna go check, make sure I'm recording things fine, because that's the last thing I'm gonna have have happen again. Is recordings being you know, well not being failed, but recordings failing. Oh, it really sucks. Because because that kind of. It's going to derails the, the momentum and that, that I start to pick up doing these videos. And I've not been doing too well at doing Cave Story videos consistently. But there's a few games I want to do and I'm not going to do four games that I'm recording. Because then, then I'll just get bogged down and I'll have no complete games. I don't want um, Armageddon to be the only game I've done all the way to completion. 
I mean, I even went back and did the DLC for that. So... I need to finish off Cave Story before I finish, or before I start anything else. I've got no shortage of games to be doing. But, it's enough rambling. That hits 15 minutes right there, so I'm going to stop it. Thank you for watching.